some of the problems in the church with Christian women and their husband is the fact that a lot of Christian women, Christian men eh, are not romantic. A lot of Christian men, you are very boring. <sighs> yep. Vlog number two, episode two. Uh, <clears throat> firstly, thank you to everyone that actually watched episode one and and everyone that actually subscribed if you haven't subscribed subscribe button is probably somewhere down there down there yeah uh find it and subscribe to this channel i'll be dropping a lot of content this year today i'm actually feeling a little bit downish uh and i have so much to do going out with going out with my brother-in-law my cousin we looking for a car we are on a mission to look for a car for an event that we have yes a whole car we've got an event and yeah i'm bringing you along with me to find a car so yep let's find a car Yo, 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 hello, hello. Jeez, uh, I'm running so late for church today. Uh, I know the last time I saw you was yesterday when we were doing the cow hunting. Yeah, so today is Sunday. Oh, Easter Sunday, pretty chilled, nothing hectic. I'm so late though, I am so late. But church is around the corner, so I'll just walk to church and enjoy your Sunday, y'all. Enjoy your Sunday. Basically, I'm giving away a gift to someone, someone that's going to comment on my page or the vlog itself. Uh, I'm going to be doing this every once in a while. In fact, let me just say every once a month, I'll be giving away a gift to a special lady because I'm, I'm sure there's a lady that has never received flowers and I'm that guy to give away those flowers. Focus because it keeps pissing me up. Perfect. 
So, this content that I'm, well, the topic that I want to talk about, it's really, really sensitive. Uh, sensitive in the manner that, as a Christian boy, uh, I'll queue it up in a video. Watch this first, and uh, yeah, let's talk about it. Some of the problems in the church with Christian women and their husband is the fact that a lot of Christian women, Christian men eh, are not romantic. A lot of Christian men, you are very boring. You are boring one way all the time. Same place all the time, always bedroom. Always you turn the light off. Your wife cooks every day. You don't take care for lunch, you don't take care for dinner. You are always doing Bible studies and prayer meeting. Marriage is not prayer meeting. Marriage is not Bible studies. Marriage is not spirituality. Marriage requires some things. You have to do some things. Christian brothers, wake up. So, yeah, like you saw that. Yeah, let's fix that. Like you saw that, uh, it's a really, really touchy topic when you're a church boy or a church girl. Uh, romance, basically. How do you handle romance when you're a church boy? How do you show your loved one that you love them? Uh, do you buy flowers? Do you have an intimate relationship like a super intimate relationship or or uh, do you have dry sex basically so adults that you have when you have kids watching please close their ears do you have dry sex do you have do you, are you intimate in that level when you're a church boy or a church girl it's a really touchy topic but in a relationship because we're all from the hood or some of us are from the hood and people say to strengthen a relationship you have to have sex but is it really do you have to uh, what like you saw in the video the pastor said church guys <laughs> Christian boys be romantic it is true you have to show your girl or your boyfriend how romantic or how much you love them like, I believe in showing love and it is true you need to show it whether it's being intimate whether it's in any form or any way so yes if you want to have dry sex do you have dry sex? I know I'm gonna get a lot of slack from a lot of people about this, but if that's your vibe, go for it. I, I did say we're gonna touch on a very sensitive topic. Go for it if you're gonna do that. If you are gonna be intimate to strengthen, quotation, to strengthen your relationship, go for it. It's, it's a matter of how you feel and how do you want to show your lover that you love them and what type of relationship do you want to have uh, <laughs> yeah so it is a really touchy topic comment below uh, if you want me to elaborate even further uh, how do you show love uh, like I said Take it back from yesterday. I'm giving away a gift to any guy, to any lady, uh, special ladies, yeah. <laughs> I'm giving away any gift. Uh, whether If you've never received roses, I'm, I'm willing to buy you roses. Gents, if you've never received a cologne, uh, yeah, maybe, I don't know. Let's see, let's see what uh, you 
I'm gonna make sure for James, I'm gonna make sure that this message is written by a lady. <laughs> I'll find someone to write to write you a message. If if it's a diary, I'll do that. Whatever. So yeah, this. Uh, yeah, let's do this. <laughs>